Thank you, Mr. Speaker. The appalling conditions of the Casabonica First uh, Casabonica Lake First Nation are unfortunately the day-to-day -day reality for police working in the Nishnabiaski territory. We have communities without police protection after two in the morning. Seventy-five percent of our officers are working without backup in remote and isolated flying communities, and we have police detachments that look little better than a shanty shack in a barrio. So I'd like to ask the Minister for Public Safety what steps he will take to step in and immediately address this horrific double standard in public safety.